Guam's 2024 budget is now on the governor's desk for review after lawmakers passed a $1.1 billion budget in a split vote. During a lengthy budget session meeting this week, the 37th legislature passed the historically high budget in a split vote along party lines. Senators passed a number of amendments during budget deliberations, which the governor's office says requires a thorough review. All six Republicans voted against the budget, arguing that excess revenues was funding several government agencies and programs and would have liked to have seen that money used for the Guam Memorial Hospital in order to pay off debts and fix its infrastructure instead. Meantime, in one of the amendments of that budget, lawmakers passed $3.6 million in order to hire new firefighters and corrections officers. The money would come from surplus tax revenue from Gov that GovGuam collected last fiscal year. The Guam Fire Department and the Department of Corrections could get $1.8 million each to recruit more trainees next fiscal year. Earlier this year, leaders of the GFD told senators they were short about 100 firefighters and the Department of Corrections said it has a very high prison population and is having trouble recruiting. Senator Parkinson said this budgeted money will invest in the long-term health of Guam's public safety.